This is Dr. B. In this video, we'll balance Zn plus CuSO4 yields Cu plus ZnSO4. Let's write down how many we have of each atom. So for zinc, we have one. Copper, we have one. And then since I have an SO4 here and an SO4 on the other side, I usually just write SO4. And I have one of those on this reactant side. On the product side, zinc, I have the one. Copper, I also have one. And then that SO4 group, that sulfate, I have one of those. And everything's equal. This equation is balanced. You don't have to do anything else. If I was asked to report the coefficients, I could say one, 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 but you don't really have to write that in because it's implied. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for zinc plus copper two sulfate yields copper plus zinc sulfate. And thanks for watching.